What are we doing today, Barkley? Well, we're going to open this bin. So excited. You think it's a pet crate, don't you? You think you're going to get treats? No, I'm sorry. Do you even know how to open it? No, you. It's awesome. Oh, we got this cool box and it's Welcome to the Wasteland, a dystopian future awaits. I love dystopian books and movies, so I'm pumped about this. Our first thing we have in here is this little, uh, it's a matrix puzzle. Nice! So oh, this is actually fun. pretty cool. It's a 300 piece puzzle. 17 and up! Because the matrix is an R-rated movie, okay? Puzzles are for all ages, the matrix is not. But in other news, t-shirt. It's a RoboCop shirt. Nice! I'm so excited for that movie. I don't know about you. I'm gonna... What? It hasn't come out yet. I'm not even... Okay, whatever. It hasn't come out yet, right? <laughs> Which is what I'm saying. This is for the new one. That's what I... Yes, I'm... but RoboCop has already come out. No, I know, but they're coming out with a new one, which is what that t-shirt is I, for. I am aware, Which is why I'm like, saying I'm so excited that. for it. That's like saying you're excited for, like, I don't know. That, okay. Well, when the new Star Trek came out, you could, you could be excited for that and be like, oh, I'm so excited for Star Trek to come out. But you haven't seen the first RoboCop, like the original RoboCop. Did, have you seen all of the original Star Treks? I think not! So, Star this Trek is cool. Okay. I'm not even going to fight with you on this. And then we have this, uh, Borbs, Dorbs, uh, oh, it's a Dorbs, like, a Dorbs. Okay, that's cute. Uh, it's from Fallout. I think that's, like, I think it's a video game. I think I've heard of that before. Oh, I know this little guy. I don't know what it's from, though. When we were at Hot Topic yesterday, someone was, like, buying Oh, yeah, that little guy. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know him. this up. Good job. Nice. So this is really cool. He doesn't have any feet. Let me see. Well, look at the little arms and he's holding the gun. Okay, well, this is great. I'm gonna go right up on my shelf, right there. Next to all my other ones. Where's Rachel? I don't know. I think she fell and yeah. I moved her when the main kit. It's metal. I don't know what it is. Time to look in the little guide book. Is it like a cookie? I have no idea. It might be like a chocolate tray or something. I think it's for Terminator. Okay, here it is. Terminator 2 Metal Print. Okay. Yesterday's enemy can be today's friend who helps you defeat a shape shifting puddle of dangerous metal gloop. Uh, we're commemorating the 25th anniversary of our favorite sci fi films with this very special keepsake. Oh, so it's just like a little. Who would like commemorable? Again, with the shelf. You could just, I don't know, put it. You can put it. Somewhere. You can put it right there. We have this little keychain. It's a it's a key, and it's a Bioshock key. Oh, it's a oh, it's a blank key, so you can get your your like house key, like copied oh, onto nice. it. Oh, nice! And it's a uh, Bioshock Infinite. I, that sounds like a video game. Uh, this is really cool. For some, a, the key to change lies within. In Elizabeth's case, it's literally in her hands. Now, it's in yours. You can display this iconic item or get it cut to unlock whatever door you choose. That's cool. We could definitely do that. And then every in every Loot Crate box, you get a pin. A pin. And for June 2016, it's the Dystopia pin, and it looks like a missile. So that's cool. So... Uh, from what I'm reading in here, it looks like Fallout is a, like, iPhone game. Fallout Shelter is what it says here, and I think that might be, like, a spin-off of the original game. I like the animation. It's kind of cute. And, uh, with the pin, every time you have the pin, you can go to lootcrate.com slash pins, and you can unlock special things. And in this case, you get phone wallpapers from Fallout Shelter, so that's really cool. So this Loot Crate had really cool stuff, and I was super, like, looking forward to it for the just when it had the dystopian theme, because a lot of times the themes aren't stuff I'm necessarily into, but with this dystopian theme, it wasn't kind of the dystopian stuff I like. Our like kind of games, dystopia is like really, YA books and stuff. Yeah, this was more video games about war and stuff, and 
I don't like video games about war and stuff. Yeah, we're we're I'm all for, a we're vegetarian. All for, I I don't like that kind of stuff. We're all for post-apocalyptic uh, photopia kind of thing. And if Tris or Katniss is shooting their bow and arrow or gun, I'm like, yeah, girl power. But if it's just a bunch of guys and guys machine guns. in their basement, their parents' basement, playing a video game with machine guns, I'm not into that. So I think with Loot Crate, this is cool for some people, but for us two teen girls. I mean, I bet some teen girls really like this. Oh, yeah. It's just, sick. But I'm like... Not us. I definitely want this t-shirt because it's super soft. I love the material, and I'm... This is, like, a I nice might steal that sleep from you. shirt. Like, you know, I'm... I'm ready for bed. Good night. Move! I gotta get in my bed! Huh? You're in my bed. That's all for now. Follow us on Instagram, Twitter, Tumblr, Periscope, and like us on Facebook. Subscribe to us on YouTube. And check back every Thursday on comicbooks.com for new videos.